Welcome to Take a Minute. I'm Noemi, and in these stressful times, I'm here to share some tips with stay-at-home moms, working moms, and everything in between moms. In this week's Take a Minute, let's talk about date night ideas. Next Sunday is Valentine's Day, February 14, 2021. Given the current conditions, it may be difficult to think of ways to celebrate with your loved one and still remain safe. Here are some helpful ideas for celebrating that special day with your special someone. The first idea is to go on a picnic. Pack a picnic basket with simple finger foods such as bread, cheese, fruit, and wine, or your favorite beverage. Sometimes a change of location can be very romantic. It doesn't matter if the location is a local park, your backyard, or on the floor of your living room. If you decide to stay home, just turn out the lights and let the romantic setting do the rest. Next, cook a gourmet meal together. Search for a meal online or dust off your recipe books and whip up a meal for two. Challenge each other to a bake-off. Even if they don't turn out Pinterest worthy, they probably will taste great and your kids will enjoy the leftovers. As a result, you will both gain confidence in the kitchen and you get to impress each other with your culinary skills. But here's a tip. Be sure to have a plan B just in case the food doesn't come out as you would expect it. Another idea is a wine tasting at home. Join a wine tasting club or simply choose a few bottles yourself to sample and compare. See which one you like best. Or hide or cover the, wine, the labels on the wine. Can you tell which is the cheaper wine from the more expensive ones? Or try food and wine pairing. See which wine goes best with different types of cheese or fruit. You can also do this with cheese alone if wine isn't your thing. Have a movie night. Yes, it may seem as if that's all we've been doing for the past years, staying at home and streaming on the TV, but how about changing it up and projecting a movie in your backyard? It may take a little bit of an investment, but your family can reap the rewards all year long. So set up some comfy blankets, pop some popcorn, and enjoy an old favorite movie, Al Fresco. Or you can try these alternatives for a whole new twist. Present a slideshow using some old photos and snapshots and create your own movie memories. Your only limit is your creativity. Or use your smartphone and create your own movie, then premiere it in your own backyard. Your kids can even join the fun on this one. How about a game night? Games and friendly competition are a great way to spine things up and spark up conversation. Use one of the following suggestions to see what happens next. Poker night, or strip poker if you're feeling a little more adventurous. Virtual game night, board game night. How about a bowling lane in your hallway, or a mini golf course around your house or backyard? Or you can make it an introspective evening. Sometimes it's just best to go back to basics and spend an evening relaxing and just enjoy getting to know each other all over again. Here are some ideas to get you started. Make it a spa night. In between giving each other facials and pedicures, the relaxing atmosphere can be conducive to some real conversation. Or write each other love letters. Sometimes deep feelings can only be expressed the old-fashioned way, in writing. Make a bucket list for the next 10 years. Here's your chance to realign your future goals and get to know your partner. Have a deep conversation. If you need help getting started, use the game such as Truth or Dare or perhaps Never Have I Ever. For more information, go to our website at www.mccallanlibrary.net and type Relationship. There you will find a list of books available for checkout at the McAllen Public Library. And this is Take a Minute. This has been Take a Minute. I'm Noemi with the Palmy Branch Library asking you to take a minute to take care of yourself so you can take care of your family.